Hey guys, how's it going? The Haggard Nerd here. Welcome back to Factorio. Last episode, we left off uh, getting our blue stuff situated, um, and our reprocessing area is finally getting built in here, which is exciting. Uh, just waiting for all the express belts and everything to finish uh, being built. Um, we keep getting attacked in different areas. Uh, one of the big ones I need to keep my eye on is uh where was it it was it was it was here it was here okay so these guys are out of ammo so i'm gonna have to go take care of that i think but you guys look like you have no power up here it's probably because it's nighttime and there's no power going up to you guys that's what i'm assuming at least you have no electricity mm. whoa you got me nervous we have electricity down <gasps> We don't have electricity down here. What's going on? What's going on again? No! Did we run out of... Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay. We ran out of power yet again. Okay. Okay. It's because these guys... They're, oh yeah, we, we are... Hmm, we are in desperate need of this area to be done. And I don't know how we're going to get out of this. I mean, we have reprocessing. We could set up one thing for reprocessing. I mean, can we do that? Do I not have any of those things on me? Oh, Jesus Christ. So I need a centrifuge. I need steel plates. Okay. I'm going to set up at least one to do reprocessing until these guys can get situated. barely hanging on but I mean is this area up here powered still is it is it working well it doesn't have any yeah we are we're just straight up out of out of stuff oh no oh no I need to do a lot more uranium processing is what I need to do This is not, this is not cutting it. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Oh, we're coming back a little bit. And as long as we can get like one or two. Oh no. I mean, this is all based on, on like chance. And there's just such a low chance of this. So I'm thinking what I'm going to do is uh, I'm just going to blueprint this. right now and my timer is in the way let's get that out of the way there we go I mean I don't want to shoehorn stuff like this in but that's what's gonna have to happen that way it'll at least double our production kind of and then just do that. Oops, no, that's not what I meant to do. And then, um, that'll all feed into that. That'll feed into that. We just need some centrifuges. And then that'll, yeah, that'll help. That'll help. It'll, it'll process things faster. And then what I need to do is set up a larger version of this uh, somewhere down here. Yeah, that, that's the thing that needs to happen sooner rather than later. Okay. Um, but I need some centrifuges being created. It seems like I need to go back to my mall and set up centrifuges. Even though we're low on power. Centrifuge. Yes. That one, please. Give me the stuff. Um... Barely hanging on. Come on, reprocessing. <laughs> um, I mean, I can't make any centrifuges because I still need steel plates. And then, um, let's drop, let's drop. What are we gonna drop? Let's drop those. Let's get some steel to us here. Let's do. How many do we need? 
50. So let's just do 500. And hopefully I'll have enough to hand make a few of these. Oh, God. If the, if the power can just hold on for a little bit, I doubt it's going to. Because it's slowly dwindling. It's quickly dwindling. <laughs> uh, it would be a lot better once you get the wrench mode going. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Ooh, power just died. Yep, that's exactly what just happened. So, yeah, everything just... <laughs> all those updates, man. That's exactly what happens. Okay, so I'm going to have to go collect some... Steel on my own. So I think we had steel to the south. Oh, I'm so embarrassed. Okay, good to know we have all that in there just hanging out. And of course, we got no power here because I really should just have burner inserters here. <laughs> I really should. Oh, this this is this is dumb. So dumb. Okay. Of course, I could put this on power on its own. You know what? That's exactly what I'm going to do. All this is going to be on its own power separated. So I can uh, do accumulators and all that good stuff. Everything's disconnected here. Let's go ahead and just connect between. So I'm not going to get any power until the daytime. That's all disconnected here. That's fine. That's all connected through there. This is... Ooh, that's messy. That'll work there. This will hopefully disconnect that. That we need to have disconnected there. That... I don't even worry about it. I mean, never mind. I'm gonna worry about it. Right, right there. Okay. And none of that connects in there. It looks like. So if I can just trace this outline and make sure that doesn't connect connect anywhere, then I can start putting down accumulators and uh, solar panels. I need more solar panels, but I need more steel for that. So let's go connect, uh, collect some steel. So we can make all the stuff we need. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that should be fine. Let's just make a whole bunch of those. Oh god, we still have all that. I almost, I almost just completely ab obliterated the area around. Uh, I was about dropped a lot of stuff, so I'm gonna go up here where I'm probably gonna drop a lot of stuff and kill these guys. Nope. Okay, fine. That works for me. Let's make a bunch of those, and I need green stuff for that, and then I also need centrifuges. That should work. And then I have uh, a few of those. Let's not make that many. Let's do like 250. Good lord. Okay, that's good. So we have some solar panels that we could just go ahead and attach here. I mean, at least that'll get the steam engines going. That might be enough to keep them going. Well, I mean, no, no, it's not. It's not enough to keep them sustained. And of course, it's definitely not enough to uh, keep them going at night. Yeah, there should be some steel at check-in. But now that I've got bots and I've got my mall, I've not been using check-in. Check-in was never as handy as it, it, it was supposed to be. I'm still going to keep it to be able to access all the trains, but uh, the drop-off is not necessary anymore. Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of some stuff. That doesn't look like it's connected in properly, so. Oh, good lord. 
W. There we go. Let's go ahead and just get rid of all this. Because it's not necessary anymore. My inventory is full, so let's get rid of some stuff. Let's, oh, good lord. Um, I'm just going to have stuff fed out into an active provider chest. There we go. And then some power there. There we go. Seems like the power is not connected in properly here. Okay. Good lord. Good lord, man. <laughs> it's like we get power for a second and then it's like nope just just done just done so now chickens no longer a thing you don't have to worry about it Torvok <laughs> it's not a concern that you need to have anymore okay so let's go ahead and continue with this There's not power poles there, but it's fine. Okay. So the steam engines. So the steam engines don't work. Motherfucker. Okay. Pardon my language. I just realized that's not going to work either. Because these have to be tied into the system in order to provide power. They don't work like the, the turbines do. Jesus. Okay. I'm such a dumbass sometimes. Okay. Well, I mean, the other option would just be go ahead and put burners in like we had before. Yeah, I got confused earlier about the whole how uh what was all that? Oh, that's that's just the thing. Okay, never mind. Um I I was thinking about how the turbines worked for the nuclear stuff. That's where my brain was. Uh thinking that these operated the same way for some reason, but that's not how they operate, so derp. <laughs> Pardon my derps, guys. It happens. It's been known to happen. It's a thing that happens. Okay. How are we doing up here? Still a whole lot of nothing because they've had no power to, to operate on. Okay, what about you guys? You guys making anything? You guys doing any progress? Any good stuff? You have no... None of that. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's, uh, let's go ahead and kill those guys. And make the centrifuges. If you wanted to, you can use the shift click and copper wires from the power to your nuclear and that. Shift click and copper wires run that power up to your nuclear and not have to tie it to the rest of the base. Um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm fine with having it tied into the base. 
I just need more processing going. Okay, there we go. There's that. So we doubled that up. Are we getting a little bit of power back? We're doing not too bad. Uh, it could be a lot better though. I'm thinking what I want to do is with the rest of these centrifuges. Just maybe go ahead and squeeze them in. Will two fit there? Two will fit there. Look at that. Let me get rid of this signal. That's not going to fit. I do one. Get rid of this. And then just continue it on down. That's fine. I mean, technically, we don't need all that. Let's go ahead and make another few of these because I'm going to need them. I'm going to need them. Oh, what's going on here? There we go. I need at least one more. Where did you go? There you are. Alrighty. I know adding more things to use power is not ideal right now, but the idea is if I can at least get it to keep up, then everything will be fine. realize I didn't attach any of those earlier. Good job. Fantastic job. This guy, they, they all have inserters going out? They do. Okay, good. So many things. So many things. Are you tied into the power? I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Just bouncing back and forth, man. Okay, so that, <laughs> that's messy. It's very, very messy. But we now at least have more of the the processing going on. And this is this is not ideal, but it's gonna have to do. I'm just waiting for. Oh, we just got no 235 coming through. Until we can get proper 235 going, then this is just not gonna happen. It's getting there slowly. we're waiting on stuff all kinds of stuff the red fast transport belts what I need to do is go ahead and make stack inserters there we go There we go. Of course, now we're out of belts and stuff. But they'll get built in a bit faster now. Or created. And then lead down. So what do we have here? Oh, we have a thousand there already. Which I realize now I could probably just uh, do that. <laughs> and then there's all kinds of circuitry and stuff here. I'm not even going to begin to try to describe how this works because I know it takes stuff in and then runs it through something and if it if it's what we need then then it spits it back out but if it's not then it it doesn't and it's 
I, I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> I messed around with it a long time ago. But it's not a pro it's not a been a priority to try to get that figured out. So let's um So the beacons. Do we have beacons available now? I don't know if I've researched that yet. I thought I did, but I maybe I didn't. So it's under production. It is under production. Oh, it's under production. All right. So beacons. There we go. So how many do we need? We need 60. Let me 56. Uh, okay. Let's go ahead and make beacons. I'll make a suggestion to reduce your fuel cell consumption, but you're not storing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, Refactoring the entire thing uh, to store steam and turn it on and off would be more efficient. I do agree, but I'm going to brute force it. And once I get enough uh, processing going, it's not going to be a problem until it is. There we go. Now we'll have beacons being created. Right. Yes. Okay. And I really am kind of concerned as to why the bots haven't been picking stuff up from me. Okay, how are we doing? They're hanging in there. Oh, I am so excited for Satisfactory, man. Oh, man, yes. That needs to happen. So what is this supposed to be? So that's supposed to bring in... Oh, I guess this is supposed to be the uranium incoming. Or did my blueprint not... There's nothing here. Okay, that goes up there. So then that would go here. Oh, there is something there. Just It's hard to see. So I guess this is where the uranium would come in down here. So maybe what I could do is go ahead and break off this stuff. Uh, so let's go ahead and do two splitters. And then what I'll do is do an underground here. There's that. Then we can do two undergrounds. Can't, I doubt it's going to reach that far. It is not going to reach that far. Oh, spaghetti factory. And what we can do is active provider chest. Hey, uh. Oh, uh, Dave, what's up, buddy? How are you doing? Bunk, bunk. All right. Oh, yeah. Did it? Did it finally? die no it's everything's just charging that's all it is there you go now you're grabbing stuff for me so we got actor provider chest here and then uh let's go ahead and put down some request your chests uh, let's do that again but a little bit further out let's do two and then we, we can do our, we need to do express uh, loaders, but for right now, the fast loaders are going to have to work. Do I have any of those handy? I do. There we are. And then I'm going to do a fast splitter since that's all I have right now. And then we'll do power. There we go. And then these guys are going to request uranium, I believe. I believe yeah that's your name okay so this is additional processing okay uh, dupe. Dupe. there we go 10 let's, let's do 100 let's just always do 100 for these <laughs> uh, doing fine thanks okay good good to hear man okay we're still getting attacked oh yeah I need to go fix that like pretty soon that is a wall of biters there, man. Holy crap. 
Yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's just go take care of that wall of biters that are up there. Oh, that's so far away. Okay. Maybe once... Once we get back, all that stuff will have... Um, been constructed. And I'm out of fuel. Good job. Good job. Just good job. I got no coal. I got no wood. Jesus. Jesus, man. The wood immediately go in my trash because reasons. Auto trash. There it is. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. I do apologize for that. Hopefully that'll be enough to get us up there. See, it's times like this where I really wish I would have invested a little bit more effort in uh, in solar farms. We have the space for it. Good lord. We have the space for it. We just haven't gotten there yet. Haven't put the time in it. It would help negate some of the bad stuff when stuff like this happened. Diversify, you know? <laughs> Just as long as no trains come, we're fine. That's all that matters. I do have ammo. I do have ammo. Okay. I was about to say, I drove all the way up here and I don't have ammo. That'd be really, really bad. I believe it's up here is where we're seeing all this. No, it's over on the other side. Jesus. Oh, out there. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's good. Oh, and you're out too. Alright, let's go. Did I leave my car here or over there? Or did I pick it up? I think I picked it up. Okay, that's fine. One of these days we'll get a locker, uh, a locker launched, a rocket launched. Oh my god! Uh, but today is not that day. See, if I would have designed my power systems intelligently, I would have had some sort of master switch where I could control, like, primary and auxiliary, uh, secondary uh, power consumers. And anything that was not absolutely crucial to the main portion of the base. I could turn those off and then have power be diverted directly to the things that require it, such as the uranium processing. So it's probably your artillery shells on a robot pressing. Uh, you know, that might be what it is. That might be exactly what it is. Uh, Demonis, hey, thank you for following. Welcome, welcome. Oh, 
Well, that means... Yeah, that's probably exactly what's going on. So I'm going to have to clear this area up. If it keeps happening, I'll, I'll deal with it. I, I got my power situation to deal with first. Or lack of power situation. Alright, so still looking terrible. Still looking very terrible. Okay. So how about you guys? Are you guys doing anything with the little bit of power you have? No, you're... <sighs> megawatts. Megawatts. Not gigawatts. Megawatts. Okay. So again... Uh... What I need to do, I think, is relocate my nuclear processing, my uranium processing, to down here. Oh, we're out of wood and coal and everything. Ah! <laughs> Mother. Jesus, okay. Okay, that's, that's, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so the only thing we have right now is a little bit of uh, solar power we got going on. Okay, I'm thinking about this. I'm going to get this figured out. So we have none of that going. We got none of that going. Oh, you know what? I just realized that this connected to the power source because uh, the thing I researched can, uh, basically made all of my um, power uh, row reports into power poles. Now we probably have connections that shouldn't be connected like this. Oh, man, that just messed me up. That just messed me up. Okay. We have six here. Ooh, that's going to help. <laughs> All right, well, uh, we're going to have to move this out of the way. That's still in range, but... Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's unfortunate. That's in range. Oh, not all nine or all ten. Yeah, so that'll give us a little bit of something to work with. Uh, I'm aware I'm in trouble, Drobuck. Trust me, I, I was aware of that a while back. Okay, if we can just get some 235 going, man. Um, if we disconnect this. Disconnect this. Disconnect this. And that. And that. And that. run this out and over to there <laughs> for now that doesn't make any sense but it's fine Now we should have a little bit of power going here. Okay, that's all connected in, right? Okay. 
I'm going to disconnect a lot of that, but I'm really just trying to put all my power into here. That's what needs to happen. This actually needs to disconnect from that. to go back and fix all this later but right now as long as I can get these working that's all that matters I mean we have power we have water we don't have water is that what's going on no water at all okay well that's Okay, now we have water coming in. All right. I realize that is feeding that. That oh, you know what? Let's get rid of that. Get rid of this. I'm really trying to funnel all this power just to my processing. What's up, Rodan? How's it going, buddy? About to have a bunch of 235s lay down because that'd be awesome. Come on, just one, just give me one. Oh, dang, okay. So, yeah, that's uh, that's not working at all. Ooh, that's not what I was trying to do. Let's get rid of that, disconnect that stuff. So 29 okay, accumulators, some lights. Yeah. So right now the only thing that's showing production. We got no steam coming out. We got no power going out of here. What's going on? Yeah, zero performance, because you get what? You got all the steam you need. You got all the water you need. Okay, so did we not connect everything down here? That's connected. That's connected. Ooh. This is not connected. That would be why. There we go. Now all that power should be funneling, funneling directly into the production of uranium. So now we have a dedicated uranium power source and it gets priority. And that's gonna actually have to connect down here too. To this stuff. Because this is all gonna be processing as well when that time comes. And that is connected in a way that I'm not pleased with. So let's get down here and disconnect from wherever it's connected up to. Like right here. There we go. Um, this is going to have to sit close enough to register those requester chests, but far enough away where it's not getting power. Same thing over here. Oh, and there's one up there too. I'm just going to put that like right here. It's good. And then we're going to have to do one more like up here. No, nope, that's not close enough. There we go. That'll work once that once that works. <laughs> So I'm going to disconnect those guys because I don't want those being too, too close. Uh, go ahead and put some power there. So you guys are 
You guys now have no anything. Okay, because we need power over here. Understood. Understood. Okay. Okay, okay. It's one thing after another after another. Holy Jesus. Okay, so now we have stuff going in here to unload the boxes. Yay. Yeah, my laser turrets are down. I'm in a very bad situation right now. I'm trying to focus 100% of my power on creating uranium-235, which is what needs to happen here. But I think, I think I'm going to have to go ahead and start wrapping up this episode. Next episode, next stream, <laughs> hopefully uh, we can uh, get some 235 out of this because uh, I'm in a very, very dire situation. And until I can get this situated, my base is not going to progress. Um, I was completely uh, naive in thinking that everything was perfectly fine. I was not keeping track of the production. I thought we were on top of things uh, when I added in that huge reactor down to the south. But um, lesson learned now. <laughs> and I am working on getting stuff situated. There was one 235. Okay, that's going to help. Uh, actually, I'm going to wait for this to go to the north before I... Uh, before I end this episode. I am going to put down some power switches, though. It needs to be, like, one main power switch to divert between uh, feeding just to this. Well, no, the, the other the other, uh, the other reactors. Yeah, they, they'll, they'll be fine. They'll be fine. I'm just going to shut them down. <laughs> I just want to see, uh, make sure that this gets up here and gets fed in properly. Uh, so many things going on right now, and it's just, it's just driving me nuts. Okay. I'll wait for this to hit here and then we'll wrap up this episode. Okay, so there's that. So now we have power going here. Rating. Can you plop down a bunch of solar? I could, but if I had a lot of solar, but we now have at least that going on. And if that can continue to power this area, we can get more. Oh, we only need one of the uranium 235s. Okay. I thought it was like 10 for some reason. And I think I'm thinking of the reprocessing is what I'm doing. Speaking of which, I should probably start considering uh, grabbing some 235 to get the reprocessing started. I think that's how that works. Here's another one coming here. Okay, I think I think we're back on track. There we go. Okay, that's much, much better. I feel like maybe I could benefit from having fast inserters here. Okay, you guys are doing good. Okay, our power is looking good just for this area, and I know I'm just getting obliterated. Yeah, that's. Uh, I need. I need to take care of robots going back and forth over here. Oh, and that, oh, that's not looking good. That's not looking good at all. Oh, no. But we're going to have to deal with that next episode. <laughs> uh, so, guys, let me go ahead and save real quick before I forget. Uh, save. There we go. So, guys, if you're new here, hit the follow button. Uh, if you're ever on the YouTube side, hit the subscribe button. If you like this episode, hit that like button. Uh, so, guys, uh, be awesome. Be excellent to each other. And I'll catch you in another video. As always, thanks for watching. Take care.